Oh, hello, my friends. Welcome once again to this fine establishment. I'm Straight Up Irish, and today we're playing part 5 of the Ultimate Tank Orc. Thank you for all your likes, dislikes, and nice comments that you left on the last video. I do love having your feedback. It really helps me out. Also, all of you sound and say like I sound and say like I don't know what I was doing with the English there. I'm very tired. You all say I sound happier than this playthrough. I am. I am. I was just so happy we got a playthrough done. Because I was going to get really, really upset that there was going to start a big meme that was already starting where I wouldn't finish things. So, I'm glad we were able to cut that by me actually finishing something. So, that's kind of why I'm happy to see that. Do please leave all your comments and stuff. I love seeing what you guys think we should do. Adding on to the character. What will get done by the end of it. So far, I'm very content and happy with what we're doing. We're just going to make sure we're still on Legendary. I have been having an unbelievable amount of fun. I would be denying and lying if, um... I said I wasn't. I actually am having a lot of fun with this character. Also, I am streaming uh, most days. I'm in the middle of an Oblivion character, so I got a bit away from the microphone here. So if you'd like to um, watch me play some of that, please do. Uh, I would very much appreciate it. Uh, we're going to get off with a little bit of um, thought process here today. So a lot of people recommended getting the... Oh, I nearly dropped my microphone. A lot of people recommended getting the Shield of Solitude. So maybe that's what we should focus on doing for now. The Shield of Solitude is... Uh, uh, God, I'm kind of like completely <laughs> stuttering here. It's a scaling weapon, or weapon, scaling piece of armor that you can get for doing the Wolf Queen quests and stuff from Solitude. So the best way for us to do that is to go straight to Solitude from its stables. I'm not sure if the Shield of Solitude is a reward for the first half or the second half of the Wolf Queen Awakens quests. But we'll see it by doing it anyway. I guess that's what we'll do for now. I have been naming the videos um, Part 1, Part 2, Part 3, Part 4, or 5. I'm not adding on something after like I did in the old playthrough. Like Part 1, let's say... Maroon's Razor Part 5 Meridius, but you know that kind of thing I was doing before, so we're not doing that this time. I'm also trying to talk a lot more in between, so I don't have to cut out as much spaces and stuff like that. Because I don't really think you guys mind when you hear me take breaths in between my sentences and stuff like that. And um, so thank you. For anyone that has actual criticism and has given it so far, I thank you for it. I haven't found anyone be mean and stuff, other than a few people who were kind of douchey, but you're bound to get douchey comments. Unfortunately, I am Irish and these are bound to happen no matter what I do. So I I think the Shield of Iskimor is a good thing to focus on getting now. Um, it's kind of weird coming from Oblivion into this and not having to focus exactly on what I need to level up by our, like the trees themselves. Because I have to focus on the attributes and efficient leveling by getting 10 skill points per attribute I want to level up in Oblivion. For example, let's say there's three skills under Strength. There's Blunt Blade and um, what was the other one? Blunt Blade and Hand to Hand. If I level them a total of 10 times between the three, uh, every two skill points is plus one and you can have a max of plus five and that's how you level up inside of oblivion so you want to get plus fives it costs three my biggest problem with oblivion right now is i'm over leveling and stuff i'm also just trying to fill in with dialogue in the gap between um me getting to my location at the end of solitude in here so because uh, I assume you guys like listening to the commentary. I don't know. I don't know if you have this on in the background while you're working. I don't know if you have this on the background while you're playing games, whatever you're doing. But if so, do make sure to leave a like if you're still here and you're enjoying this playthrough so far. I would very much appreciate it. And I look forward to all the ones we're going to do in the future while we wait for the next RPG, RPG games and such like that. Also, because it wouldn't be a normal video if I didn't chill at least once, do consider becoming a sponsor of the channel for as low as $2 a month. I do thank all of you at the end of every video. You're given some credit. I do have a Minecraft server that you can be led into with it uh, and I also do sponsor only streams here and there at least once a week anyway so that's a thing so thank you for that and yeah if not thank you for watching anyway I appreciate it now let's Varnius uh, Junius do his court stuff and we'll have this kind of get a start on man this is actually just kind of a question because I'll be so I'll be traveling in like a month a month and a half two months all right and I was gonna say during this pandemic here, right? And if you have an answer, I do want your opinion, right? But I want your opinion if it's logical, all right? There is most of the, like, there's, like, let's say you're on a plane. Are the chances of you actually getting COVID on a plane low? That's kind of my question. That's my question, all right? Are they low? Because I'm trying to, I'm, some of my friends have gone travel. They've come back, you know, they've been fine. And I'm kind of just 
trying to put myself into a position where I don't think I'm going to get it on a plane. I know there's always a chance, but I don't think you will. I don't know. What do you think? What do you think? Anyway, we're going to go and do the man who cried wolf. We're going to go and clear out Wolf Skull Cave for Falk Firebeard and start this towards getting the Shield of Solitude. Again, we won't have massive scaling on it because we're only level 7. It would be better if we could get to level 10 by the time we do this. And so far, I have been leveling up. What have I been leveling up? We've been leveling up Alteration. We've been leveling up Smithing. We've been leveling up Heavy Armor. Uh, we haven't put a single point into Heavy Armor. Uh, we've been leveling up Block. We've been leveling up One-Handed. Yeah, I haven't put any points into uh, Heavy Armor yet. So, let's do that. We'll increase our armor rating by 20% because we had an extra perk to spare there. Do I level up my alteration by using alteration spells in um, a city? I assume we don't. Yeah, I don't think we do. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go to Catalyst's farm and we're going to go up the slope. And then we're going to head all the way towards Meridia's beacon statue and stuff because we'll be coming there later. I did forget I was a vampire. None of you really said to cure myself by one person. So, I'm going to assume we're not curing ourselves from this. I guess, maybe, don't know, you'll see. I don't know, man, I'm having a lot of fun doing these playthroughs. I do like making the normal videos I do and stuff like that, but for some reason, these are a lot of fun. I consistently get the same amount of you watching them, and that kind of makes me feel great about them, you know, that I can do something. Like, it's kind of mad to me that over, like, a thousand of you watch me play this game religiously. No matter what episode I do. That is nuts to me. I find that bizarre. I always underwhelm what I actually do, but I'm like, man, it's just, that's absolutely nuts to me. I don't know, thank you, I'm grateful. I'm in a chatty mood today. I'm very tired and I'm trying to keep myself awake. <laughs> we'll clear out Wolf Skull Cave for sure anyway. I know a lot of you really want me to do the DLCs in one of these playthroughs. We will. All right, we absolutely will. I can see Dragon's Bridge up ahead there. All right, so the cave is this way anyway. So we're going to head and get the uh, the word from here. The word is for the um, Elemental Fury, I think that's what it's called. And we'll have the temple so we can fast travel here later when we do get Meridia speaking. Because I do love getting Dawnbreaker no matter what character I'm in. As long as I use one-handed in some form, you can use it to um, progress yourself through Draugr Dungeons. Because the enchantment that sets them uh, ablaze and to explode when they die is a great enchantment to have. Oh, the word wall's over here. I can't spray because it's not nighttime, so it's a little irritating, but it's whatever. Yay, we got air. Elemental fury, boys. Alright, so up here towards Wolf Skull Cave. Um, and we'll just clear it out. That's my objective right now. We're going to continue to use our stone flesh spell uh, and stuff like that. Uh, I leveled up again. Look at this. Let's um use a point into... Okay, you know what? I think I will actually level up again let's put two more points into magic it just to get it to like 180 or wherever it is i will cure myself i think feck it i don't really want to be a vampire if i'm going to be anything with a tank character i should be a werewolf i did say i was going to start the companions to you guys like three episodes ago or something i'm pretty sure i did i cannot wait to get quick reflexes it's so powerful let's do a uh, juggernaut two why not you know for the crack high so let's set our stone flesh up here there is some skeletons over here uh we'll take out our We'll let them hit us a bit. We'll let them hit us just a wee bit. Wait, did that kill me? Oh, I forgot my health is much lower here. Oh, man, I don't think I made a save. Oh, I did. Thank God with the leveling up it did. All right, I need to cure my vampirism, boys. I might actually go and do that now. Yeah, I might go and do that now. Ooh! Damn it, man. I don't have Janassa here. For some reason, she's just kind of gone missing. I got Wolf Skull Cave unlocked, so if I can kind of just run away, I'll be fine. Wait, what vampire spells do I have? Vampiric Drain, Vampire Servant, Vampire Seduction. Does it not work on skeletons? Jesus Christ, man. Jesus Christ. What about if we can just kill this skeleton? A quick save here. Can I heal? Ah, we can kill these two, I think. Can I get up? There we go. All right, we're going to go to Morthal instead. I've changed my mind. We're going to go and cure our vampirism now. <laughs> it's going to annoy me otherwise. Man, what's everybody's favorite Minecraft mod pack here? Thank you for answering my zombies question the other day, by the way. It's nice to see most of you agree that Cunard or Toten is the best, solely because of nostalgia, even though we all know the Black Ops 2 zombie maps were probably the best in quality. They put the most amount of effort into them, and let's be honest... Uh, the giant ass robot was pretty goddamn cool. But well, what would be your favorite Minecraft mod pack for any of you to play it? Because I know a bunch of you for sure play it. And for anybody who does want me to, I will be doing a Skyrim modded playthrough. I absolutely will for one of the next ones. I think I told you guys what I was going to do for the next playthrough. I can't entirely remember what I said I was going to do. Um, this is not working. I know someone asked me to do Illusion. I know I'm not doing Stealth Archer. 
God, I told you guys what I was gonna do. What the heck did I say I was gonna do next? I don't know. We'll worry about it later. All right, Falian's house is open. I think we have to go and get rumors first before we do this. Let's buy a black soul gem off him now. Yes, they are unbelievably expensive, but we'll need them later. So we gotta go to the inn here first for a second. Because uh, we need to get rumors. Because that's the only way to find out that Falian can apparently cure us. So we gotta run all the way over here. Notice board mod, I keep forgetting I have it. Get down from there, lure back. Give me rumors, woman. Oh, we got some work, cool. Just get in a bunch of rumor quests, and then we got the College Winterhold quests. Oh, we'll do it as the story. I'm not doing the quests, but we'll just get all these quests in our log. I'm only really gonna do quests that give me rewards that I can use anyway, you guys know yourself. So, we have a bunch more. Let's go to miscellaneous. Let's, um... Did I not get it? Rising at dawn, there it is, yeah. Fally in! I heard you're an expert in vampirism. Does the gem I have filled? Damn it! Man, they're both empty. Let me... Let me just try and do this. I don't want to go and buy soul capture just to get a black soul gem. Oh man, we might have to. Ah, oh, feck it. I'll just buy soul trap and use it. Once, just to get this. Did I clear out Silent Moon camp? No, we could go... We'll walk over there and we'll get a bandit from there. We'll just get one and we'll come right back. Because I don't think these guys have spawned again, have they? Man, I tell you. The rain out here is fierce right now. Can I... I have enough magicka to do it, so that's fine. I'm kind of scared to run into any saber cats. I'm pretty sure there's skeevers around here and stuff. So we'll cure our vampirism. We'll clear out Wolf Skull Cave. Uh, they're our main objectives here. And then we'll do the second part of it in the next episode we do or whatever. Because otherwise, what's going to happen is my stats are down during the day and it's kind of annoying. I think I might go as far as getting 200 magicka in total. But I'll go and switch between each one. Like I'll fluctuate between health and magic and health and magic. Let's use vegetable soup here. It's in food, sorry, my bad. It's probably gonna be another five, six episodes before we have to farm out and do them again. We'll take the lunar stuff. We'll take the red apples. Take these potions, because they're handy. Uh, we'll open up this bad boy chest, take the gold, the garnet. All right, let's head on out here. There's an easy bandit to kill over here. Oh man, it's one of them wee magic pricks behind me. All right, so. Let's kill this bandit. Give me your soul. Ma! Ah! Loud noises! Do I have... Do I have health potions here? I do! Let's just kill these fuckers. Die! You made me swear, hooker! Give me all the stuff you have. I'll take your grilled chicken, bro. Let's go kill the rest of the bandits up here. Why not loot this place? I mean, we're here already. Why would I come here kill one bandit? And it's tiny anyway. There's only a couple more bandits left, so... I do like the Wolf Skull Quest, um... Dungeons. I do think they're a lot of fun. Alright, let's kill this, um, female. Can we kill her? There we go. She's dead. Let's, uh, take all the loot from this bandit here. Heal. Although our Berserker Rage is probably about to run out, so. Man, we... Look how much damage we do when... I'm playing an Orc as well at the moment in my character on, um, Oblivion. So that Berserker's Rage is a lot of fun in that as well. It's just that being a vampire can just kind of be a bit annoying. We are about to be full inventory-wise. So we kind of have to be careful here. But that's mostly because I have iron. Bandit killing time. Hit me! Yeah, where is she hit me? No! I have vegetable soup whammin. You will never win this battle. Quick save. Give me your golden loot. Stagger! Quick save! That's, no, he doesn't have anything I want to take. Janassa, move! Power attack. Power attack. Yeah, boy. Let's check out this chest. Got some cool loot from this. A garnet. Okay, I need to drop some of the stuff I have. We don't need the Iron Dagger. Don't need the Orcish Dagger. We don't need the Staff of the Familiar. We don't need the Fur Armor. We don't need... Ah! See, we have a lot of food as well. Now nah, we'll be fine for now. I haven't been using my Alteration Spells. Look at us, man. We're leveling up fast and mighty. God, we really did kind of trail off here and do other things, didn't we? I don't- I want to say this episode will be a longer one because I've kind of spent more time doing some random stuff. But it might not even be all that long again anyway. Like, it might be long for me, but it won't be long for you guys. Depends on how much I talk, it's that kind of thing. I'll eat the flower. I have no reason to keep the apples. I'm thinking of doing the next episode on- Wait, did I open up that chest? Let's go back to Morthal. Now let's go talk to our bad boy here. To the summoning circle, my friends. To cure this vampirism. See, I don't feel like it would be fair on you guys to just do a vampirism quest. I feel like we could do more. Yeah, look, man. Oh. When we have our full magicka. Hit me! Just be careful here. 
Don't let him hit us, boys. Don't let him hit us. We can screw him up. Formidable foe. God, we are actually nearly leveled up again. I wonder when we get to 10 by doing Wolf Skull Cave. The higher the level we are, the better the shield, so... Oh, it's Movart's Lair or whatever it is, isn't it? Alright, let's make a save here in case there's a glitch or something. Let's wait an hour. Let's wait another hour. Isn't it something like, like midnight or something? He comes by. I know it's like dawn or dusk. Yeah, it's dawn. Isn't this dawn now? Oh, here he is. Alright, let me just... Okay. Oh, come on. Please tell me it hasn't broken, because this quest can be really, really buggy, and it's annoying. Oh, thank God. All right, let's do this. Oh, man, I was really scared there for a second. <laughs> oh, thank you. Yay. Oh, man, we're not a vampire anymore. All right. So it's back to normality. Okay, so let's make a save here. All right, cool. Let's go and do Wolf Skull. Before we go to Wolf Skull Cave, a quick stop. I don't know if some of you want to know when I do these things, but I'm letting you know anyway. So you'll just know what's happening. Um, I'm going to disenchant any spare stuff I have. So later when my enchanting is higher, you're not going to be like, Oh, hello, Fally in 2.0. Be like, James, how did you get there? And I'll be like, I did this here, my friend. Uh, Poacher's Axe, and not a complete. No, 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 amigo. Uh, Poacher's Axe is cool and all, but we're going to just... I don't, I'm not going to... I don't care. Oh, no, I should have kept it. Oh, sure, it's an axe, like, hey, why didn't I, I'm not thinking all here, hey, you need to hell I'm doing, didn't you, Jesus? I am, man, I'm insane. All right, let's put another point into blocking, so it's 25% more effective. Uh, thank you, block. Into white run, the mighty white run, we're going to Bellathors. Am I? See, my carrying capacity has gone down by, like, 30, 40 points, but whatever. I don't think I'd die by this jump. Aye, I didn't, because me legs are strong, hey. Hello, Bellathor. What do I have to sell? Lunar swords, steel arrows, iron arrows. Let's sell the amulet of Talos. The keep the amulet of Arcade. We'll keep the Mara one. We'll get rid of the silver necklace. Let's get rid of all the magic potions we have. I'm probably not going to use them. Uh, get rid of the berserker potion. We're going to sell the apple pie, the chicken, the horker loaf. Let's get rid of these gems as well. We don't need these. Let's get rid of the pelts. Let's um. Let's go turn these into actual leather. I'm gonna get rid of the gems. Um, I should definitely get rid of these. So we have 220 out of 300. I don't have a house yet, but maybe that's what I'll do next time. I'll get a house so we can start storing things, because storage is gonna start being a problem otherwise. So I wanna go and just turn these into leather. Oh, hello, courier. Who are you? Oh, is it the Falkyrie? Yarl of Adarable Daryl, yeah. Cool, we can do his quest next time or something. That's it. Uh, I don't know why I learned courage. I'm not. Wait, will I be using courage? I don't know. Well, right, we have that quest now as well. We have a bunch of quests in our log now. Jesus. Move, Adriana. I don't want to be inside you. Wait, right, does this weigh more? Leather weighs more than wolf pelts. Really? I guess I'll just turn it all into leather strips. I don't really want to sell any. So, cool. So, let's head to Wolf Skull Cave now. In we go, boys. I've never wanted to delve so deep into a hole in all my life. <laughs> Let's spam our alteration spells. Look, man, we're going to be able to cast four of these soon, and that'll just be cool. Just to level us up, you know that kind of thing? Sorry, Drugger. Let me get some vegetable soup down me fucking... Oh, I forgot to... God damn it, man. I forgot to um, make the potions out of the spare ingredients I had. Let's heal here. They usually don't have too much cool stuff, but whatever. We'll go with the flow, hi. Hey? I'll bait this one, Janassa. You bait the other, right? Give it the old one too, will ye? Ah, Janassa, come on now, hey, will ye? Give them the old one too, will ye? Fuck's sake, man! Stupid old whiny bitch! Bless us and Jesus and save us. Oh, no, I'm going to... I'm going to stagger you, woman. Oh, no, 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 no! Help me, hey, now, Janassa, will ye? Ah, bless ye. We're going to fuck these boys up, we are, hey. Do you think you'll be taking them downtown now, do ye, apprentice necromancer? I won't be having none of this stuff now, I won't. I don't know why, I'm kind of having a lot of fun here. <laughs> I don't know what that's going on. I'm sorry, I, I don't mean to be like this. Ah, bless us and Jesus, apprentice necromancer. Christ on a fucking cornflake, I can't be dealing with this right now. I can't, you wee hooer. Got to get you out of here now, I do. Bless you, will you close your legs, you'll catch your cold. I don't want you to catch your wee cold, will you? Close them legs. I know, I know, I know. Don't worry. I understand, hi. Can I? Ooh! He is fucking strunk, hey. That is strunk, boy. He is big menacing, big boy with big willy. 
Seriously, that's actually kind of nuts. What is this health? What is this health? Look at this high, like. What is this? Why is this high? Am I actually just gonna have to use Berserker Greaves here? Boys, I think I'm going to have to, like... I don't know what else to do. Like, we're barely putting a wee dent on this boy. Look at this! Janassa, will you get closer, you fucking dickhead? Why are you? Go on, will you? Go on! Go on! Go on over! Go on! Go on over, will you? Go on! Go on over! Have a wee gander, will you? Ah, Janassa, come on, will you? Go what? Look at her! She's doing a wee few spins. She is now on the back of the club high. This is the longest fight I think I've indulged so far in Legendary Skyrim. I'm having a bit too much fun here, man, to be honest. I'm going to have to wait 24 hours, though. This is definitely going to be a longer episode than all the other ones we've done so far. It absolutely has to be. I cannot imagine why it wouldn't be. Like, it literally has to be. It, like, it has to be. I've talked so goddamn much. Ah, bless us. Please tell me I haven't come down too soon now, hi. There's still an enemy back there, but I guess we're just going to ignore it. I guess there's no wee saving now. There's a skeleton high. Well, lad. You well? Such a cool shot. Oh, Lord, bless us and save us and Jesus and maze us. Alright. Hello, novice necromancer. Can I blow you up with a wee bit of fire now? Hi, can I? No. Janassa, if I could take that bow and shove it up your wee hole, I would. I just want you to know. Ah, bless! Am I dead here, like? Oh, come on, man. Where is this nutcracker? This woman. She's not. She is. Seriously, where are you, Janassa? I don't really know what else to talk about. Like, like, what statistic com like combat comments would you guys like here? Like, did I kill her by accident or something now? Is that what's happened? Because I don't know where she is now. Oh, we fucked him up. We did, hey. Look at him. He goes bye-bye. All right, we're going to wait 24 hours. I should get the mod that skips this, man, but whatever. We do this like a real man. We wait. Right, well, we have our feckin' thing now again. We'll take these robes and the owl potions. I actually don't know where Janassa is. So I'm starting to feel like I'm gonna have to do this on my own. I know I didn't kill her back there. I absolutely did not kill that woman. I'm just gonna have to keep fucking doing this, man. There's nothing else to do here. Ah! I thought I could kill him in time and then heal. Oh, no! Janassa? Ah, bless you, woman. You came over to help us. You did, hi. Ah, bless your wee heart. I'll light a candle for you tonight, I will. Just, man, as long as we keep... Am I, is my vegetable soup ran out? Are you joking me already? Oh, yeah, we waited 24 hours, sure, so would have. Sorry, novice necromancer. I do like that extra health regen and stamina regen I'm getting, so. And you're not really taking that away from me, I'm going to be honest. Let's just keep power attacking the old restless dragger here. Ah, yeah, no, man, this has to be Lon. Honestly, I'm kind of happy we're going to be 10. That's what I wanted to be when we did this. So I am very happy we're about to be level 10. We will get to level 10, so that's fine. Let's just keep making wee saves here going along. Keep leveling up our um, alteration and all that. Ah, it's only a wee Baba Drogger. Still, the two-handed weapons are nuts. I can't wait an hour now, man, but it's whatever. We'll just keep going from here, we will. All right, this part might be a little hard. One, two, three, power attack. One, two, power attack. Save. We might, might have to um, use our thing here. Man, I really can't wait to play the Shivering Isles for the first time. Like, I really can't wait. I, I have to heal here. I'll just be careful. Let me take out my stuff here. Okay, he's a restless dragger, so we gotta be careful. Walk on over here, my friends. What's on this guy? Ten gold, flames, orange dart wing. I do not understand why tomes and healing, or uh, healing and flames are tomes. I don't understand if everyone is giving them. Why can't we go back to where characters were given certain spells, like really unique spells, depending on what they picked in the class? I miss the class system, man. God, I hope they bring it back. God, do I hope they do. Like, I mean, it's like my most wanted feature. Oh, no way did we not level up from that. That's so, that's so sad. We were so close. I'll have this recorded today, but it won't be out until the day after because, I mean, it just won't be. Oh, no. I used, um... Berserker's Rage, because it's an apprentice um, necromancer, and these guys, mages, man, just in general. They annoy me. Like, look how much faster we're killing her just doing this. Oh, well, we know we won't be able to wait 24 hours, so we better just hurry here. Yeah, we better hurry and get up and kill these guys. Go, 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 go! Kill the necromancers! Did they glitch out? I think the ne necromancers glitched out, guys. I'm not sure what's happening here. Oh, I'm after running out. Crap. Be careful. I'll let your NASA head on up. So what's on her body? Nothing. 
I guess we'll just take the torch bug stuff. Where's she gone? Hi, oh, she's down here. Sorry, Necromancer. I want to kind of corner spam you. Just kind of keep you here. We kind of got through this faster than I thought we would. Like, it took me an hour to do all this nearly, like everything I've done, so... I think we've made good progress. Actually, I think I can do apprentice level... Um, spells now for- we're gonna get our health up to 150 and then I'm gonna start putting points into magicka again. So I think I can get my alteration up to- yeah, we can do apprentice level alteration spells. Cause next we'll be able to get, um, uh, we'll be able to get this here, magic resistance. Cause that's what I wanted to get. So we'll get apprentice alteration. So we'll be able to- I think it's- I, I can't remember if it's stone flesh or iron flesh. I think this is oak- yeah, this is own flesh- or oak flesh. So stone flesh is next. Think of it like in a Minecraft way, you know, man? Alright, we'll get him into the corner as the, the other one we killed here as well. I think he's the last boss here. Or enemy, sorry. There we go. Feckin' hell, man. Nice one. Nice, nice, nice. Good job, Janassa. Oh, no, there's one more enemy. There's one more. She's up here, the Ritual Master. Ah, it's an old bat, hey? Sorry, old woman. Why are you looking down there? Don't be looking between my legs. Look up here. My eyes are here. Look straight into my eyes, woman. I won't tolerate this. No amount of punching will have me unprepared for what I'm at stake and ready for here. I've been hit by worse women than you. I have ritual master. There we go. Goodbye, Potema. You evil old bitch. Go look. Have fun. I'll see you later to put you away. Put you in your fucking place, I will. I won't be putting up with any of this. Alright, that's all. Maybe the Shield of Solitude is the first quest. That would be super cool. Because I'll have gotten a piece of armor you guys recommended to get. A lot of you, and then we got it. Right, let's turn this off. Let's turn the miscellaneous quests off, and let's get our reward here. What are we on? We're on 230 out of 300 carrying capacity, so I do have a bunch of stuff I want to sell, so. And we hit level 10. So we're open to a bunch of new quests now. We really filled our quest log up this time. Shield of Solitude? Shield of Solitude? No! Well, putting the old Talos horn down, Torig's horn, uh, get us the Shield of Solitude. I know it's not going to take us long to do if we do it. It'll just make the episode longer anyway, so it's not a big deal. Yeah, let's head from Grey Winter Watch up to the Shrine of Talos and put the old horn up. Maybe that will, because we're helping people solitude, so. But I think we have to do both Wolf Skull quests to unlock the ability to get property. I know there's usually a Saber to Tiger down here, because there's always Mud Crabs. Yeah, the Mud Crabs are over there. Like, it's not hard to do this little miscellaneous quest for us, so. What did I say? What did I say? Oh, come on. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Oh, my God. No, no, no. Damn, man. Man, I think I'm in trouble here, boys. Oh, go. Get the wee hell out of here. I will high now. That's the exact Saber 2 Tiger I was telling you I was scared of. The exact one. I can't hear the game because I'm listening to music, so. All right, we're free. Go, 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 go. Back to the Blue Palace. Why am I teleported so fast or far away from the entrance? Let me be closer, my friends. Hello, fair maiden. Yay! I can do it! I can buy, um... I can buy Thinimajigi. I can buy property. I have to help more people in the Halfinger hold, so I don't know. Maybe that's it. But I can now spend 25,000 gold and get property. I know I said I was going to get Breeze Home or something, but I really don't want Breeze Home. Like, at all. It is cheap, like unbelievably cheap to decorate it and all. Overall, it'll only cost you like six. Ah, oh, there's jerk. It'll cost you like six thousand um, uh, gold in total. Jeez, man, we have a lot of quests, don't we? My right, Bella Whore. I'm gonna take my mace out just in case. I'm gonna have to do this the hard way. But let's see what we can uh, sell you, my friend. Why do I still have his horn? I still have Torig's war horn. I guess we'll sell it high. <laughs> gonna do what I tried to do earlier. Just gonna make as many of these out of what we have. Let's just get rid of all these so we have a bit more carrying capacity. Can sell these random potions for some money. You know, because we're just collecting all this stuff, so I don't know. I don't know, man. Man, I bought a fucking uh, calzone from a place last night. And uh, they didn't they didn't deliver. I didn't get my food last night. I paid for it all. So I went to the place today and they said that the driver came by and all that crap. They didn't. The driver wasn't here. They said they tried to ring. They didn't try to ring. But by God, do I know I'm never going to this place again. Alright. I mean, Alchemy to 17, boys. Hey. Let's uh, take our mace. Quick save. What have you got for sale, fair lady? Sell all this stuff I don't need now, hi. God, we really do have a lot of crappy potions here, don't we? Alright. I mean, how much room do we have? We have 210 out of 300 still. I can't wait to get that perk, which makes our heavy armor cost nothing. 
Wait, why is... Ah, the usual spot now, boys. Let's make a manual save. We're gonna stop it here. Boys, thank you for watching. Again, I really, really appreciate your support. I'm enjoying this playthrough again. Thank you for all your support and so far. And thank you to anyone who sponsors me. If you don't sponsor, consider becoming a sponsor. But for those who are sponsored, I would like to thank you. To those of Tier 1 friends of my eek, Mark Kra, Lelosaurus Rex, Numbnuts, Get Good, Tiffany Lee, Sven Grun, Rodrigo, Cataphractus, LNSTRR, Dragonfire481, the one and only G, Anjo or Jorke, or Jorke, I'm sorry how I mispronounced that, Sam Rivas, Aviator, Nathan Scarborough, Jess Ambrose, Elf Daughter Crafts, Count Andrek, Beelin, Zane Harrison, Dustin Ogdowski, and Victoria Brower. Thank you, you're all incredible people. I love you. To those at Tier 2, Dragon Slayers, Vid Begonia, J8 Tech, Mike from Texas, Bo Zephyr, Mariana Flore, Wade, Dandy Indoorman, Metaspedo, Evie Rubin, David, that German guy, Morgan Gibbs, Noah Burt, Weatherseed, Staz, Poet Fox, G Daddy, Michael McConnell, Zachary Fluke, and Jar Jar, thank you. I appreciate you. You're all amazing. And to those at Deirdre or Deirdre God, big thank you to you guys. Shaley Benton, Sensacre, and Monkey Egg, Jerome the Sheep, Der Kaiser, Perturbed Dork, Orion, Eyes of Fork, Calebar, Just a Random Otaku, and Caius. Thank you. You're all incredible. That's it. I'm gonna go now. I'll see you later. Peace out.